What is the units digit, last digit, of 2 to the power of 2021 plus 3 to the power of 2021 plus 7 to the power of 2021? In this video, I'm going to explore a very popular topic on math contests, and that is known as the units digit, sometimes known as the last digit, and sometimes referred to as the ones digit. And what you do in these kinds of questions is you look for a pattern. You write down some of the first few powers of any number and see what the units digit are and if there is indeed some sort of a repeating pattern. So I will first start with 2. And I will look at powers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. So 2 to the power of 1 is 2, and therefore the units digit is of course just 2. 2 to the power of 2 is 4, units digit is 4. 2 to the power of 3 is 8, units digit is 8. And similarly, I'll fill in this table. We have 16, and therefore 6. 2 to the power of 5, 32, and therefore 2. 64, 4, 128, 8, and finally 256 and 6. So just if you look at the first 8, you'll see that there's a repeating pattern. 2, 4, 8, 6, 2, 4, 8, 6, like that. All right? So if I want to find the units digit of 2 to the power of 2021, do I have to keep doing this? And the answer is no. You just have to look at what I do is the fourth units digit, and that in this case is 6. So that means every multiple of 4, you will see that the units digit will be 6. Every time the exponent is a multiple of 4, the units digit will be 6. So the first thing we want to see is this exponent, 2021, is it a multiple of 4? And unfortunately, it's not. But that's okay. What about the one immediately preceding it? 2020. Is that a multiple of 4? And the answer is yes. 2020 divided by 4 is a 505, which is an integer. So therefore, this is a multiple of 4. And therefore, its units digit will be 6. Now, 2021 is the very next exponent in this pattern. And therefore, it will be 2 as the units digit. So as you can see, you don't need to figure out the big long number. You just have to look through this pattern. So we got the units digit of the first one. In a very similar way, let's now work with 3. So 3 to the power of 1 all the way down to 3 to the power of 8. And I'll fill in those values, 3, 9, and so on. And for each of these, let's list the units digit. 3, 9, 7, 1, 3, 9, 7, 1. And as you can see, we again have a pattern. And very, and very similarly, we want to look at the units digit for 3 to the power of 2021. Every time the exponent is a multiple of 4, the units digit in this case is 1. So for 4, for 8, and so on. Now, is 2021 a multiple of 4? No. 2020 is a multiple of 4. So therefore, that units digit will be 1. And therefore, the very next units digit in this pattern, which is 3, is the units digit of 3 to the power of 2021. So that takes care of 3. And now we get to our final one, 7 to the power of 2021. So we have 7 to the power of 1 all the way down to 7 to the power of 8. And now let's fill in what these numbers are. And therefore, the units digit will be 7, 9, 3, 1, 7, 9, 3, 1. And again, we have a pattern. In a very similar way, 7 to the power of 2021 is 2021 divisible by 4. Unfortunately, it is not because if it was, it would help us because we know that 4 as the exponent gives you a units digit of 1 
and any multiple of 4, such as 8, also gives you a unit's digit of 1. But not to worry, because 2020 is a multiple of 4. 2020 is a multiple of 4, and therefore its unit's digit is 1. Therefore, the unit's digit for 7 to the power of 2021 will basically be the next one in this pattern, which is 7. So there you have it. The unit's digit of 2 to the power of 2021 is 2. The unit's digit of 3 to the power of 2021 is 3. And the unit's digit of 7 to the power of 2021 is 7. And if you add them all up, you will get 12. And the unit's digit of 12 is 2. And therefore, that is the unit's digit of this big number.